morning everyone. Welcome to Catherine's Plate. On the menu I have stuffed peppers in a crock pot. I'm so excited about this menu. I'm going to be able to put this thing together and then have dinner ready this afternoon. And this is everyone's favorite also. So let's get started. All right, so we're going to cut down the front, move the top, and then we're just to release the seed pod from the membrane and the pepper. We're just going to go around the edges there. I use a spoon and just pop it out, and then anything you don't want in there, you just kind of remove. And there you go. Okay, we have all of these cleaned out now. Now to get them to sit up straight, you just want to, because they it may wobble, just come to the bottom of the pepper and then just give it a nice little, really, really close to the ends because you don't want any leakage there either. There we go. And just kind of straighten them out to where they stand up. We have five of them ready to go. We are prepping the onion. We're doing a dice on it. So go down about three quarters of the way and do slices. Not all the way to the end, but just right there. Kind of lift it up. Go about three quarters of the way once, and then come a little bit more towards the front of it. And again, lay it down and start cutting. Okay, to start the stuffing for the inside of the peppers, I have one pound of ground beef. To that, I am going to add one cup of rice. This is already cooked. One diced onion. One cup of mozzarella cheese. If you want to use other types of cheese, you can. You can use Colby Jack or cheddar cheese. We have two tablespoons of Worcestershire sauce. About a pinch of pepper. And a pinch of salt. It's whatever you want in there. And then I'm going to add half a jar of tomato sauce. This, it's like a spaghetti sauce, but this is Le Classico. Whichever brand or whatever taste you like. All right, we're going to save the rest to add later. All right, now we're going to start stuffing the peppers with the ground beef mixture. But first, before I do that, I'm going to go ahead and add about a quarter cup of my, my sauce into the bottom of the sleeve of the crock pot. This will keep the peppers from sticking to the bottom and help steam it. Just gonna give it a shake. Good. All right, now we're gonna start stuffing. And go all the way to the top with these. Just like that. Look at that. Alright, put these in the top pot. Okay, now what I do is I pour a little bit of sauce onto each pepper. It's 
sprinkle my rest of my mozzarella cheese that I had grated on top of those. Now I'm going to put the whole thing into my crock pot. That. We're going to plug it in. All right, we're going to cover up our peppers now. Okay, I've got my crock pot on low. This is going to be good for six to eight hours, or you can put it on high for four hours. So we will check back with this later on this afternoon. All right, it has been six hours. We are going to check our peppers in the crock pot. I'm going to take the lid off. Look at that. Look at those. Oh my gosh, I am so ready to eat one. We're going to go ahead and take one out. Can you see those? We got the green ones, the red, and then there's a the yellow one right there. So let's just dive right in. Oh, look at there. Okay, here are my peppers in the crock pot. So we're going to give this a try. Mmm, that is so good. That was worth waiting all day for. Everyone's home tonight and they are ready for me to spoon these out. So. Make sure you comment down below on my video and let me know what you think about my peppers in a crock pot. Also, also, let me know if you have other recipes that you'd like me to do along the way. Um, hit the like button and give me a big thumbs up on my dish and make sure that you subscribe. I have videos that come out on Mondays and Thursdays and some surprises along the way. So I will see you on my next episode.